having been a landlord, if you get a good tenant, yeah. Because on the other hand, one bad tenant could just blow everything up for you. And uh, I lament that, particularly in 2020, but there has just become this trend to demonize landlords in a way. Whereas, you know, I consider housing, you know, a basic necessity, shelter of life. People who provide basic necessities should be honored and cheered. Yeah. Uh, and so I consider being a landlord a noble profession. Uh, and again, most landlords I know, and myself included at the time, you're going to work with people. If you have a good tenant, you're going to work with them. The tenants who don't get worked with are bad tenants. Yeah. You know, and again, we kind of miss that. And that's not to say, sure, every profession has a couple of abusers in it. And you should deal with that directly. But that's not by just like, you know, there's there's certainly some percentage of renters who are bad actors, just as there's some percentage of landlords that are bad actors. But I don't think we want to paint a broad brush on anybody.